What's up, everybody? It's Tyler here standing in for Cameron on Super Cam TV. At least my name is Tyler. T Y dash Lur. Tyler. Okay? Please get that right. That's very important. Listen, I want to talk about an epidemic. And it's people uh, that are having a lot of different babies with di different daddies. Have, you know, three different babies by three different daddies in the last three years. Listen, y'all need a hobby. Find out how to do a Sudoku. Quit making people. If the food in your from your first date is still good by the time you're pregnant from that man, it's not the man's fault. You just, if you let a guy spit at one of your ovaries just because he bought you a Nacho Bel Grande, that's just kind of how it's going to work for you. And it's sad and it sucks, but I'm just saying. Some of y'all ladies are out there having babies with men with who have who have apartments that you can't even find the bathroom yet in the dark because you, you don't even know them that well. If you can't find the bathroom in the dark, how are you going to find, you know, 18 years worth of ways raising a little person? That doesn't make no sense at all. I'm not saying don't have your funds, do you, girl? I'm just saying maybe, you know, let them finish somewhere other than in your uterus. You know what I mean? Maybe take a splash to the face. Live a little bit. Get excited. Who knows what could happen if you just decided not to make people every time you decide to have a penis inside you. I mean, things about the men who knock you up and don't want to spend time with you. You know, you got three baby daddies and none of them want to be with you. Maybe you should look at the fact that there's three men that are willing to write you a check versus spending time with your ass. Maybe read a book. Get some education. Try to better yourselves because something about you just, you know... Makes it not worth the effort. To the men's side, fellas, for the love of God, please quit coming to women. I understand that it feels great, you know. Vaginas are squishy and marvelous. But I'm just saying maybe, you know, finish on our thigh. Yeah, it's not as great, but it feels better than having to go, you know, to sonograms with a girl that you hate. That makes no sense at all. Fellas, if a, if a girl tells you she's pregnant, don't be an asshole. Because here's the deal. You might be being an asshole to the mother of your child. And here's the, here's the thing. Once you find out that baby's not yours, then you can be an asshole. Listen, you know, it's hard to feel sorry for you when you've got three kids with three different people. It makes no sense that you're on there complaining because here's the thing. That's kind of in your control. Now, I understand, like, if you have three kids and your husband leaves and you're just stuck with three kids, that's completely understandable. But if you're like, oh, this guy ain't shit because he just left me and my babies. Well, so did the other two guys. Well, you should, they should get together and I'll talk about what your crazy ass is doing to make them go away. You should just do a focus group. Like a small little focus group with, with the three guys that have all come inside you successfully and made a baby. And then just ask, be like, hey guys, uh, why do you, why would you guys rather send me a check once a month? I don't understand. What could I be doing differently? And I'm probably going to be uh, Don't Smash After Taco Bell in, in the early movie. It's the early movie because it's cheap. Just so you know. Hey y'all, thanks for watching this. Hey, listen, if you all like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It makes me feel all warm and fuzzy, and if it helps make you feel better about it, tomorrow's my birthday, so you can just do it like an early birthday present for me. That'd be real nice if y'all just like and subscribe. Please, thank you. All right, please uh, have a have a have a have just a great day, and for the love of God, just wrap it up. Or take it to the mouth. I don't care what you do, just stop having babies.